Hi, in this session I'm going to cover how to open multiple files at the same time. So this would be helpful if you work on the same files day in and day out, maybe like two or three files every single day, and the location of files generally do not change. So let's say in this example, I have three files that uh, I usually open. It's uh, Two of them are in this folder, socks, this shoes and socks uh, file, and then in this workspace too, this shirts file. What I can do is I can create a workspace, and what happens is when I open this file, it opens up all three files at the same time. So this saves a little bit of extra time. So this just makes it easier for you if you open the same files every day to work on it, and they stay in the same location. So let's see how we create a workspace. Let me go ahead and delete this. Let me go and close this. Don't save. Uh, let me go and just exit here. And uh, don't save. Don't save. Uh, let's see. And I'm going to go ahead and delete this. I'm going to go ahead and just delete this file. All right? And so I'm going to go ahead and just open up one of these files. Let's go ahead and open up the shoes file. And let's go ahead and open up another file. Let me go and go into my Windows Explorer, open up my socks file, and then go ahead and find my workspace 2 and open up my shirts file. So we see, you see we got a couple of worksheets open or workbooks open. So let me make it a little bit neater. So I'm going to go under view and just go ahead and arrange all. And you can either have them tiled horizontal. This is what it would look horizontal. And maybe I'll have them all like that. And there's other arrangements that you can have. Earlier I had them tiled or I can have them cascaded. So it just depends how you'd want to see them. This is cascaded. It's a little harder to see. So I'm going to stick with, uh, let, me see, let me try vertical. Yeah, vertical is not bad. So I'll stick with vertical here. And let's say I work with these three sheets at the same time. And what I want to do is basically create a workspace file. And that file has the .xlw file extension. So to do that, you would have to be in view and go under save workspace. And it's going to ask you to, to save a workspace file. And I'm going to go ahead and save it in a folder, this main folder. I'm going to call it 3s, 3s close shoes, shirts, socks. And once I save it, it's going to ask me if I want to save all, uh, well, this asks me if I want to save all of it because I have a randomized formula here to randomize the digit, the uh, values here. So I'm going to click save all and that's for shoes and I'll go ahead and close it now just to show the examples. So I'll go ahead and exit out of this and close that. And now I'm open up my workspace main. This is the file that I just saved. You can see it's a workspace folder. Double click on that. And what's going to do? It's going to open up all the different workbooks. So this is an easy way to open up multiple workbooks if you happen to open up the same workbooks day in, day out. So I hope this helps. Thanks for watching.